searching for the good in our neighborhoods and each other. Not just finding what's wrong, but what's right. A true reflection of Cincinnati. Find the good in your mornings. Good morning, Tri-State. This is WCPO 9 News. We thank you for choosing us. I'm Evan Millward. Here's a look at some of the top stories at this hour. The streak continues. Your UC Bearcats remain undefeated, clinching the AAC title. The Bearcats beat Tulsa 27-24. Now UC fans are looking forward to Sunday to see which bowl game they will end up in. Nilo Lattimore has been missing more than two weeks and even strangers are now helping look for him. North Star International K-9 Search and Rescue led the efforts along the Ohio River Saturday. Volunteers covered 21 miles on land and water but didn't find anything. It was one week ago. Nilo's stroller was found near the Purple People Bridge near his mom's body. Prosecutors now say Nitesia Lattimore was stabbed to death by her boyfriend Deshaun Brown sometime around December 5th. They found her body on the 12th. Police suspect foul play is involved in Nilo's disappearance too. And a heads up for drivers 7175 northbound will go to one lane north of Burlington Pike for a few hours Sunday. This is so crews can finish some things before the Brent Spence Bridge reopens. The lane will be closed until about 2 p.m. Then the current traffic pattern that tapers down to one lane at 275 will come back. All right, it rained through that whole Bearcat game and there's a lot of change in the forecast. Here's Sherry. Hey, Sherry. Yeah, hey, there's the last day of fall and we're done with the rain. We could see maybe an isolated sprinkle first thing in the morning, but some patchy fog and also uh, clouds out there. We uh, again will certainly see those clouds break later during the afternoon. Temperatures not budging a whole lot upper 30s to low and mid 40s for a high on Sunday here today. Uh, again, we start our day with the clouds and then we're out of cloud cover and we have our temperatures fall into the 30s tonight but it feels like 20s when you wake up monday morning 